Back in Nigeria, the National Industrial Court of Nigeria, NICN, has ordered the Academic Staff Union of Universities, ASU, to call off its ongoing nationwide strike. ASU has been on strike since February 14th to press on the demand for improved funding for universities, a review of salaries for lecturers, among other issues. Several meetings between ASU and the federal government have ended in a deadlock. Consequently, the federal government went to court to challenge the strike. James Igwe, counsel to the government, prayed the court for an interlocutory injunction restraining ASU from taking further steps as regards the strike pending the determination of the substantive suit. The court therefore restrained ASU, whether by themselves, members, agents, privies, or so ever called, from taking further steps and doing any acts in continuance of the strike action pending the hearing and determination of the suit filed. The ruling by the Honorable Court is very consistent with rule of law. It's also a recognition of the fundamental role that education play in development, in national development, in economic development. And also, um, it recognizes the fact that without education, there will be no rule of law. I, I thank the judiciary. Uh, for saving um, educational development. What has happened is that the past seven months, um, educational development has been halted, particularly in public universities in Nigeria, which ought not to be. Because when that fundamental pillar on which development rests is halted for seven months, it means the, the entire um, economic, the entire social development is also halted, which ought not to be.